Hi there, it's that Dave guy here, and today I want to talk about the Beatles Red and Blue compilation albums, also known as 1962 to 1966 and 1967 to 1970, which are two landmark collections now packaged into one box set that provides a comprehensive overview of the band's career and have now been updated with half-speed mastering on 180 gram vinyl, not to mention some extra tracks, which include the new and probably final Beatles single, Now and Then taking it to 75 tracks on 6 records. So is that all the Beatles you'll ever need? Let's get into the video and find out. Nineteen sixty two to nineteen sixty six, the Red Album. Released in nineteen seventy three, this compilation covers the Beatles' early years. It features some of the band's most iconic and influential songs from their Beatlemania era. The album opens with the energetic Love Me Do and includes hits like She Loves You, A Hard Day's Night, and Help. It showcases the band's evolution from their early rock and roll sound to more sophisticated songwriting and experimentation. The album also includes tracks that highlight the band's vocal harmonies such as Nowhere Man and Eleanor Rigby. Overall, the Red Album captures the essence of the Beatles' early years and serves as a perfect introduction to their music. Nineteen sixty-seven to nineteen seventy, the Blue Album. Released alongside the Red Album, this compilation covers the Beatles' latter years. It showcases the band's transition from pop-orientated music to a more experimental and diverse style. The album opens with the psychedelic masterpiece Strawberry Fields Forever and includes iconic tracks like Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds, Hey Jude and Let It Be. It also features songs from their critically acclaimed album Sgt Pepper's Lonely Hearts Club Band and the groundbreaking Abbey Road. The album highlights the band's musical maturity innovative production techniques and introspective songwriting. The Blue Album provides a comprehensive overview of the Beatles' latter period and demonstrates their lasting impact on the popular music scene. The Red and Blue Albums were released during a time when the Beatles had disbanded, making them a nostalgic reminder of the band's incredible legacy. They served as a retrospective look at the band's evolution and showcased their musical growth over the years. The track lists for both albums were carefully curated to include the band's most popular and influential songs and now feature the latest release Now and Then, which was a little bit of a letdown for me. Each album captures the essence of a specific era in the Beatles' career, allowing listeners to experience their musical journey. The Red and Blue albums introduced a new generation of listeners to the Beatles' music and solidified their status as one of the greatest bands of all time. These compilations continue to inspire and influence musicians across various genres, showcasing the timeless quality of the Beatles' music. In conclusion, the Beatles' Red and Blue compilation albums are essential collections that provide a comprehensive overview of the band's career. They capture the band's evolution, music growth and lasting impact on popular music. Whether you're a long-time fan or new to the Beatles' music, these albums are a must-listen and serve as a testament to the band's enduring legacy. Whether this collection is enough Beatles for you is totally your call. I like the Beatles, but not enough to collect every album in their discography. And this box set gives me all the Beatles I'll ever need, and this particular edition sounds fantastic with the half-speed mastering treatment, and an overall excellent presentation. Very pleased to have this in my collection for sure. Thank you for watching and if you've enjoyed this video why not give it a like and while you're here how about subscribing to the channel. Take care, stay safe and I'll catch you on the next one.